Tony, do you want to kick us off questions? Yeah, uh, obviously a tough loss today. Uh, Rain seems to be that team for San Diego Wave, which just always seems to be tough. Uh, here at the Challenge Cup, uh, can you kind of walk us through some of the dynamics and the difficulties with this good overall Rain team? Yeah, I would definitely say great possession style team. They definitely can get a shift and over. Um, they were able to find pockets of space and exploit that and open up and play through us. And I think that was an that was an area that we definitely needed to work on. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Do you find it a challenge to play on the right side as a right back opposed to being on the left side as a left back? Um, Actually, I'm, I'm right-footed, so um, I find that playing on the right is a lot more natural for me. Um, I played on the left in college some and stuff, so I'm like familiar with both sides, but I'd rather be on the right, anyhow. Yeah, the team was really strong as a forward. Can you talk about what it was, um, the challenges with defending her? Um, yeah, I mean, she's just super quick, um, strong, like explosive girl. Um, I've played against her, I think, since, like, because she went to NC State and I went to Duke, so uh, we, like, had a little bit of a matchup sometimes over the years. Um, but, yeah, she's just tough to defend because she's so quick and, you know, she's always moving off the ball and stuff. So um, it's definitely a challenge, but one that is, you know, ni it's nice to have a battle. Later on in the season, it'll be without, uh, without I think we have a deep roster. I think it, the most difficult part is just that chemistry piece and continuing to play with one another and understanding each other's tendencies. Um, I think tonight was a great test for us for that reason. Uh, how big was tonight to uh, be able to play I think it was great. Um, definitely fun to see some girls get their debut out there. Um, but yeah, it was super enjoyable and I'm really happy for them. Yeah. I, uh, yeah. What's the message from Casey? It's a challenge cup match, but if there are defeat like this, what's the message from Casey's team? Um, kind of to just, you know, be upset about it for a second and then we have to move on and look forward to like recovering and preparing for our game on Sunday. Um, there's no time in this league to like dwell on losses. Um, so just kind of letting this one roll off of our back and, you know, review it properly and stuff. But we have to look forward to the game on Sunday that we have. Mia, how did it feel for you just to be out there? Obviously, Challenge Cup presents opportunities for players that don't necessarily get a lot of playing time. So what did it feel like for you to be uh, it's just, I mean, like, the games are, like, the biggest reward for a player, I feel like. And so just to be chosen to play and, and to start and stuff and to um, just be on the field with everybody and see all of your hard work come to fruition on the field, it's, like, super rewarding. Even though it was a loss, um, getting the minutes in the tank is its so special. And in such a good team like this, in such a good league and stuff, its it's so special, so... I'm really happy about it. And it's got to help with the confidence, right, especially yeah. heading into this next month, right? For sure. For sure. It prepares us all for, you know, when when people leave for the World Cup or when we have another Challenge Cup game. Um, we all, like, we know that we can make it through these 90 minutes. Um, obviously, there's things to work on, but now we have that in our bank, and so it's it's good moving forward.